we've developed a composite sheet pile levee system. What it is is two composite walls which are joined by GA grid. The purpose of the GA grid, it stacks the soil vertically, not horizontally. In a normal situation like this where we have 280 tonnes of soil in the wall, it should fall open, but it doesn't. And there's a big advantage in using this uh, polymer material because uh, it is more flexible and the sand behind it and the sand between the two sheet piles is mobilized so that is more taking part in the whole uh, strength of the structure. Engineers find it very hard to grasp the concept. So what do we need? We need someone that did all the modelling, the testing, the calculations and the real stale testing that actually showed that this product works. At first we made a design of the test setup and that was quite a challenge. We made a steel structure which is holding the sheet pile. Those sheet piles are upright, uh, can, can move just like that because then the sand is also going to contribute in the strength. So quite a long job indeed. If you have a brain cancer or a tumour, you go to the best doctor, you don't go to someone else. Deltaris are a leader in what they do and what they make. Basically it worked out that Deltaris are the brain surgeon that we would like to go to. This type of uh, testing you have to do on full scale because we have the complex interaction of the waves of the water and uh, the sand in the structure itself. That is something you cannot do on small scale. This is a project that has been 10 years in the making. People say that half the problem is knowing what the product's going to do and look like at the end and I think Deltaris is going to put a thousand words into one picture or one video. We have a lot of devices in it measuring how it responds to the hydraulic forces. We gather all those data from our instruments and with those data and a numerical model that we calibrate, we can make designs for all kinds of circumstances. To make an earth levy to match this, the earth levy footprint would be 150 to 200 metres. Our footprint is only 4 metres. In our wall we have 280 tonnes of soil. In an earth levy there'd be 6,000 tonnes. Again, environmentally, uh, cost-wise, it all just blows out. But basically we're here to stop the disaster before it happens because all the heartache and all the money is spent after the disaster. If we could stop 90% or even 50% of the disasters happening, it, it's just a win-win situation for everyone.